Welcome to Graper Works. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and if you do, please like, subscribe, and comment. Today's video is on a laser cut Christmas Village shadow box. I purchased the plans from an online retailer that sells plans for lasers, cre cuts, and printing. After receiving the plans, I used TurboCAD to edit and change a few things from the original plans. I used RD Works to set up for the laser processing for all but one layer. The layer I didn't use RD Works for, I used Lightburn to set up the files and wanted to test out how Lightburn works with my laser. I never used Lightburn before and so far I'm really impressed with Lightburn and the options it has to process files and images. I cut the parts on my 50 watt CO2 laser engraver using a 2 inch lens, 10 mm speed and 45% power. The materials I used were a 1 8 inch plywood, various colors of spray paint, sandpaper and super glue. Each layer took about anywhere from a minute up to 5 minutes to cut and process. All 10 layers were lightly sanded after they were cut and then painted. After painting them and letting the layers cure, I then glued up the layers. After the layers were glued together, I then trimmed the top, bottom, and sides to remove the charring from the laser cutting. After trimming, I then made a cover from the top layer waste material to cover the internal parts and protect them from spray paint. And then I painted the top, bottom, back, and sides. I spent about 30 hours making 10 of these laser cut Christmas Village shadow boxes spread out over two weeks. I always cut some extra for mistakes, needing an extra gift, and etc. There's always something that comes up where we need one more. These are the gifts that I make for my wife's friends, which the men call the Branson 8 because of their annual trip together to Branson and there are eight ladies. If you have any questions, please feel free to add them to the comments and I'll respond. Hope you enjoy the video. Thank you for watching Graber Works, and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did like the video, please give a thumbs up, subscribe for future videos, and comment. Thanks again. Mm -hmm.